we don't get the only change, okay? A therapy used to treat the symptoms of Parkinson's disease and depression may also help boost brain memory. Doctors at the University of Florida are testing deep brain stimulation on people with Alzheimer's disease. A DBS device delivers electric impulses to specific parts of the brain, tweaking brain activity. Research shows DBS enhances brain activity when electrical impulses are targeted in the memory region of the brain. Patients enrolled in the study have to be in the early stages of Alzheimer's disease. We want to make sure that if we tickle this area of the brain that we're going to actually see meaningful benefits in, uh, in these patients and it would be very exciting if it turns out to work. UF is part of a multi-site clinical trial testing this new approach for treating Alzheimer's disease. 20 patients will be enrolled in the study across all of the centers. Any change there? Half of the patients involved in the study will have their DBS devices turned on. The other half will be able to turn them on after a year. This is the best way for us to tell if there's a real response versus a placebo response just from having the, the surgery. And it's very tricky to measure memory and cognition and how well you attend to things. And so these things can be very tricky. And so there's a, a very careful blinding that's uh, been employed. Currently, there are not any cures for Alzheimer's, and there are only a few ways to treat the symptoms. Researchers say DBS is not a cure for Alzheimer's disease, but it could help enhance memory for a few years. At the University of Florida, I'm Chris Bilge.